Hi there, thanks for joining us for this week's edition of Silent Sunday Night. I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Tonight from 1926, one of the true legends of the silent screen, Lon Chaney, stars in The Blackbird. Lon Chaney was the man of a thousand faces. More than a nickname was a tribute to his ability to play grotesque or horribly afflicted characters and play them with intense humanity. Chaney's look in these films was a testament to his groundbreaking artistry with makeup. In The Blackbird, Chaney gives us two of those thousand faces, working without much makeup at all. He plays a thief known as the Blackbird, and to help him stay one step ahead of the law, the Blackbird also has a second identity as his own twin brother, a kindly disabled bishop who runs a mission to help the needy. This marked the fourth time Chaney collaborated with director Todd Browning. They ultimately made 10 films together. In Chaney, Browning found his ideal leading man, an actor who could play roles no other actor could, or even more importantly, play roles no other actor would. Lon Chaney not only didn't mind playing monsters, killers, fiends, or criminals, he relished those parts. He loved the challenge of showing that no matter how evil a character seems, he still has some remnant of humanity inside, perhaps some chance at redemption. The Blackbird is considered among the best of the Chaney Browning collaborations from MGM in 1926, also featuring Owen Moore. Here's this week's silent Sunday night classic, The Blackbird. 